Welcome back guys and in this video we are going to see how to perform mouse hovering using our selenium web drive script okay so let me open ebay.com and then i can you know show you that what basically mouse hovering is okay so i'm opening here ebay.com and here you can see that there are various options such as home saved electronics motor fashion collectibles and art sports okay and so on right so you can see that when i am moving my mouse over these particular icons or you know options uh, without even clicking the output is coming right so something is being displayed over here without even clicking over these you know uh, icons or options right so they are turning blue and then something is appearing if i you know hover my mouse over sports then something is appearing regarding sports and leisure right so i do not have to click and things are happening this is what we call as mouse hovering okay for example just moving your mouse over this and something will appear right so let us hover our mouse over collectibles and art right so using our script we will just open this website and then our mouse will hover over here and then this will open right you just see the output what is happening when we'll move our mouse over here then home and garden is opening right this remember this this will open when we'll run our script right so what do we need in order to hover so i am writing here selenium web driver java docs wait for a while selenium web driver java docs okay and then i'm opening package org.openqa.selenium and then we can move to you know actions class this particular class is required in order to you know uh, perform certain actions over the you know web page okay let me click over here and show you so this is the actions class and it has certain methods but via which we can perform some uh, you know operations over the web page which we have opened so we have various methods and we will see them one by one here we need to hover over to the you know this particular element uh, which was the element this collectibles and art right so we need to hover over the uh, collectibles and art element so we need to move to element and here is the move to element uh, method and it requires you know a web element target so what we need to do is that we need to provide the locator of uh, that particular uh, web element where we need to hover over for example here we need to hover over collectibles and art therefore we need to provide the locator of this collectibles and art in a web element kind of object and then we need to provide that object name here in this particular bracket right or we can provide the x and y offset of particular element for example if you need to move over this particular search button then you need to provide the x and y offset of this particular search button right or you can provide the web element target and x and y offset as well right so let me move to the script over here and uh, we have you know invoked the browser that is the chrome browser let me remove this chrome browser we have invoked here and then we need to move to the website ebay.com so let me remove the old script and let me provide the ebay.com url control c and pasting it over here right and then we need to maximize our window and then i am writing here driver dot find element and then by right and then x path and then we need to provide the x path of this particular element right collectibles and art so i am inspecting over uh, the web page this particular element and we can see that this is the uh, tag a tag responsible for this collectibles and art and copying this particular x path right so let me paste the x path over here so we have collected the x path of the particular collectibles and art right so we need to store this in a web element kind of return object right so you can see the return type of find element is web element so i'm writing here web web element and then element okay so element is the object and web element is the return type and we have stored the locator of uh, collectibles and art this right collectibles and art in a web element kind of uh, object right this is the element so element has the locator so now we need to create the object of the actions class so actions action this is the you know uh, object and is equals to new and then actions right so the actions class or the constructor of the actions class takes driver reference okay driver right so we have created the object of the actions class and given the driver reference right so we need to import actions class import actions from org.openqa.selenium.interactions okay so we have imported now this action object has all the methods available in the action class so we will write action and then as soon as we provide dot then all the methods will come right so we will write here move to element right so move to element and then it has taken element one by its own right 
so it will move to element one on its own and then we need to write action dot perform right without this you know calling the method perform our action will not be performed for example let me show you if the uh, java doc is open yeah so we can see here a perform method you can see it perform right the return type is void and you know uh, a convenience method for performing the actions without calling build first okay so it is used for performing actions and when you perform multiple actions then you need to uh, write uh, dot build also right so we will see this uh, later on uh, but uh, right now you just see perform okay so we need to write the perform so now let us save the script and then run the script and see that whether it is hovering or not right so let me run the script and the chrome browser will open and then ebay.com will open and then maximize the window and on its own it will move to collectibles and art see it moved to collectibles and art the collectibles and art turned blue and home and garden and all these things appeared right as we have seen earlier right so this is how we move to the element and this is how mouse hovering is performed right if you are unable to see let me provide a wait and again rerun this particular concept so i am providing thread dot sleep okay sorry dot sleep and then I'm providing seconds to wait here and then closing this particular line. Let me throw the declaration, right? Throws interrupted exception. So saving the script, running it. Now you'll see that how things happen, right? So it again opened eBay.com, maximize the window. And now see, see the collectibles in art. Keep on seeing collectibles in art. It will turn blue on its own. It turned and then home and garden open, right? So this is how we perform mouse hovering. I hope the video was very, very clear to you. This is how we hover over the element. We will meet in the next video. Till then you keep learning, keep revising and keep watching. Thank you.